Once you have logged into Simple Pay for the first time, you will be given a demo company to work with. In the top left corner, you will see the name of the company you are working with. If you have more than one company, a switch link will appear when you hover next to the company name. Clicking on this link allows you to change the company you are working with. In the top right corner, you will see the profile icon. This icon allows you to access various profile management pages. The Companies page allows you to add and delete companies in your profile, switch between companies, and set a company as a default company when logging in. The Billing page allows you to manage your billing preferences. For example, you can select your payment method, view an invoice or statement, or update your billing emails. The User Profile page allows you to change your password or switch between accounts if you are a user on more than one account. For example, you can switch between your employee self-service and payroll administrator accounts. You can also enable two-factor authentication on this page. Manage Users allows you to give other people access to your account, with various permission roles determining the restrictions placed on such other people. You can also remove users in this section. The Notifications page allows you to see all notifications that Simple Pay has issued to its users regarding new features, upcoming maintenance, or legislative changes. The Logout option allows you to sign out of your account when it's not in use to ensure that your payroll information remains secure and protected. To the left of the profile icon is the Help icon. It gives you access to a wide range of useful articles and videos on our help site and allows you to send an email to our support team should you need further assistance. The employee search bar to the left of the help icon allows you to quickly access an employee's profile by searching for an employee across all pay frequencies by name, employee number, passport number or identification number. If you wish to search for an employee within a specific pay frequency, you can do this using the employee list, which will be covered in a later video. The chat icon in the bottom right corner allows you to start a live chat with our support team during office hours. This allows you to get speedy assistance for short queries while you are working on the system.